Good morning, everybody, and a very happy International Lolita Day to all of you! As you can see, I am still very much in my pajamas. It's early in the morning. I have to work today, but that's not going to stop me from getting up to some super fun activities for International Lolita Day. Now, I usually don't do much of anything special for International Lolita Day, but this year I wanted to try and do a few different things to celebrate. Now, it actually took me a lot longer to recognize this than I would have hoped for, but we actually have two International Lolita Days throughout the year. We have one that's on the first Saturday of June, and then one that's on the first Saturday of December. So here we are, and I'm ready to celebrate today. So let me put together a quick little list of what I wanna to do today to celebrate. So even though I have to work today, I would love to pick out a cord to wear while I'm sitting at my desk and getting some work done. So I'll definitely have to pick out an outfit. And of course, I'll have to make a lovely cup of tea for myself to enjoy at my desk, because what's the point of wearing Lolita if you're not also going to enjoy some tea? Then I want to get outside for a little bit, maybe take some cute fall pictures, go on a walk. And then finally, I would like to go out and enjoy some Lolita-centric activities with my friends. Well, I think that is going to be my full list of activities I want to do for International Lolita Day. As you can see, I've got quite a bit of work to do to get prepared for it, so let's go pick out an outfit and uh, pull myself together. And of course, if you do enjoy this video while you're watching, feel free to give it a thumbs up down below. And if you wanna stick around for more Lolita and Kawaii Lifestyle content, I do post new videos for you guys every Thursday, so feel free to hit that subscribe button down below as well. There we go, that's a little bit better, I think. I'm looking a little more human. Uh, I wanna give you guys a little cord rundown. I just threw together something super simple to sit at my desk. So here is what we are working with. Like I said, super duper simple because I'm just sitting at my desk. Uh, I've got a matching skirt and the head bow from Baby the Star Shine Bright. This is like the first Lolita blouse that I ever owned. It's definitely from Taobao. I have no idea what brand, I'm so sorry. And then the socks are also from Baby the Star Shine Bright. And of course my little Usakumia slippers are also from Baby. So I definitely need to sit down at my desk and work a little bit today, but first, why don't I pour myself a nice cup of tea? And this little guy right here is actually my very favorite tea for like around Thanksgiving and Christmas. It's a sweet orange spice black tea from Tea Forte. I think I might have used this in one of my um, spilling the tea videos, which I have a little playlist of. I'll link that up above for you guys if you want to check any of those out. Alright guys, it is a little bit later now. I've gotten everything that I needed done taken care of at my work desk, so now I can just enjoy the rest of my day. The sun has finally come out a little bit. It's been a very dreary day today, but I'm seeing a little bit of sun now, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and take a little bit of a walk outside, get some cute photos, but I think it's probably a little chilly, so let me do a quick little outfit modification and we'll go outside for some pictures. Y'all, it might be the first weekend of December, but it's still literally like 
80 degrees outside. I am sweating so bad. I deeply regret this beret and the cardigan, but I hope that it at least made for some good photos. And if you want to check those out, they will be posted over on my Instagram, which is always linked down below for you. The event that I'm going to later is actually a Christmas tree lighting festival. We go every year. It's so fun. This year, it looks like it's going to be extra fun and festive, so I can't wait. And one of my favorite things that they do at this festival is a wassail tasting. Now, what in the world is wassail? Well, it's just another word for hot cider, basically. So almost all the cute shops and restaurants around the town square where the lighting is actually makes their own wassail, and they have it out for you to taste and sample so you can like walk around the square, look at all the decor, taste the wassail that each of the shops has made, and it's a competition. So at the end, you decide which wassail was your favorite, and you can vote online and someone will win. And because it is a festive holiday event, I'm gonna go ahead and throw on like my only Christmas related dress that I have. And it's actually just about time for us to go. So I need to hurry up and change. So huge surprise. I took a super long time to get ready and now I'm late. So I really need to run out the door, but I do need to give you guys an outfit check first. So here is the look for the tree lighting festival. This dress is from Baby the Star Shine Bright. The top is from Angelic Pretty and my socks and my shoes are also from Angelic Pretty. I'm gonna go stuff myself into the car. Let's get on our way. All right, guys, we have arrived. My husband is back here retying my bow because I did a very poor job of it on my own. Um, we're gonna try to find our way into the festival. We've got a little bit of walking to do, but then Hopefully I'll have some beautiful festive scenery to show you. So hopefully it isn't too loud in here. Uh, my husband and I just stopped in for some coffee. Iced coffee though, because it is so hot and humid outside. It's a little weird seeing all these Christmas lights and festive sweaters when it's literally like 80 degrees with, thank you, with like 100% humidity. But here I have... Justin got hot chocolate and I got an iced coffee. So we're just gonna hang out and enjoy our iced coffee and wait for my friends to get here. <laughs> Yes, he's here too. Hi. All right, guys, so we got here a little late and most of the people are not like putting their wassail out anymore, but the ice cream place on the square made wassail ice cream. So I'm going to have to give that a try because not only is it our only option, but it looks really good. That's insane. That's insane. I have to tell my husband who's holding you guys that this is insane. It's so good. And uh, considering it's the only wassail I've had tonight, you're going to get my vote. Here's Mary in her beautiful Christmas attire. Try the wassail ice cream and let me let me know what you think. It like matches your cord too. Super guard, guys. It tastes like Christmas in a cup. Okay, so Mary and I are about to get our caricatures done. Mm -hmm. I'm very excited. <laughs> we'll see how they tackle these dresses. <laughs> Well, 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 I just arrived home and look who has been underneath our flocked Christmas tree. Cicero has, he's got snow all over him. 
Well guys, as you can see, my lipstick has pretty much worn all the way off, but I have made it safely home. I had a lot of fun today for International Lolita Day. I hope you guys also got up to something really fun and did something to treat yourself or just spend time with some of your Lolita friends as well. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here though. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day wherever you are in the world and I'll see you next time. Bye!